The reason for this message is to address an issue that affects us all, water. Clean water, healthy ecosystems, and productive waterways are the foundation for life on Earth and this sport we love. We're in grave danger of losing sport fishing on the California Delta. As well as many places like here in the Florida Everglades, especially the largemouth, the smallmouth, and the striped bass. The loss of black bass, stripers, and other sport fish will eliminate an estimated $500 million annually from tackle sales, marinas, boating, lodging, and other related commerce in California. Water has become more valuable than oil, gold, or diamonds. The people behind this water grab understand this and hope that you never will. While this problem has started in California, it's already becoming a national issue. This is something that's going to affect everybody in the whole nation. So, so listen up to this. Uh, Congress, California Fish and Game Commission are actively pursuing laws and regulations that are going to eliminate game fish from the California Delta. And its tributaries. As they are the targeted scapegoat. Scapegoat. Scapegoat species being blamed. For the decline of the salmon and steelhead populations. The peer-reviewed science data says unequivocally no. 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 This is not true. Water is a public trust resource, and it's something that we've got to protect and take care of. It belongs to all of us. Our responsibility as anglers is to give the fish a voice. And to make sure that public trust is being upheld. Our industry, our sport, and our human race relies on clean water. American waterways and anglers aren't represented well politically. This needs to change. Please get involved. Learn about what is affecting your local and regional waterway. Don't just think someone else is going to handle it for you. So do your research. Just follow the money. Follow the money. Follow the money. Follow the money. And share the information. And please, let's make our voices heard. Every voice counts. If we don't speak up, we don't have a voice. United we stand, divided we fall. Do whatever you can do. The future of our sport, our industry, and the future generations, like this little girl here, hangs in the balance. This battle has started in California, and it will come to other states if we lose this fight. We need to act now as concerned anglers and conservationists. Organizations that are giving fish a voice are www.alliedfishinggroups.com, www.restoretheDelta.org, and in Florida, bullsugar.org, captainsforcleanwater.org. I'm Kevin Van Dam, and I support this message. I'm Gary Dobbins, and I approve this message. Hey, and I'm Roland Martin, and I approve this message. I'm Chris Zaldane, professional bass fisherman, and I approve this message. I am Mish Monroe, and I approve this message. I'm Dave Mercer, and I approve this message. I'm Mike Iaconelli, and I approve this message. I'm Mark Daniels, Jr., and I approve this message. I'm Fred Rambanis, and I approve this message. I'm Conway Bowman, and I approve this message. I'm John Sherman, and I approve this message. I am Jimmy Reese, and I approve this message. I'm Bill Dance, and I approve this message. My name is Edwin Ears, and I approve this message. I'm Bobby Barrick, and I approve this message. I am Aaron Martins, and I approve this message. My name is Don Iovino, and I really approve this message. Hi, I'm Chris Lane, and I approve this message. I'm Jay Ellis, and I approve this message. I'm Cliff Crochet and I endorse this message. I am Cody Meyer, and I approve this message. I'm Byron Velvick, this is Camber Velvick, and we approve this message. I am Skeet Reese, and I approve this message. I'm Mark Zona, and I absolutely approve this message.